Back in March, Fox 31 first reported that the Doherty County School System owed the Water, Gas, and Light Commission $400,000 in federal E-rate payments. Now, those payments provide schools with wireless internet and other technology-related items. The federal payments stopped because of the system's Title I expenditure issues. It was alleged that several employees' children were receiving free or reduced lunches without qualifying for them. The school system decided in March to make monthly payments to Water, Gas, and Light, and as of right now, they've paid $420,000, which includes the monthly payments they owed on top of the outstanding balance. And we want to exercise good faith to show them that we were, our intent was to make sure they were made whole. And uh, the intent was that we would pay them $60,000 a month until the USAC began paying them the amount that was in arrears. Dyer says Water, Gas, and Light is supposed to get some of that money back from the Universal Service Administrative Company, and when that happens, the Doherty County School System will get money back as well.